Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Now let me try and get my camera up a little bit. Now I got this box of yarn sent to me from a lady called Sarah Weller. Thank you so much Sarah. She emailed me and said that she had some yarn that she hadn't used and would I like it and of course, of course I would like it and it, it's brilliant it really helps out my channel when people send happy mail so we'll get this opened up and we'll have a look and see what's in it now i've got a basket down on the floor and we'll see if we can get in to this without cutting through anything oh that's pretty oh look at the colors on this Oh, Molly's coming. <laughs> he runs. Oh, ice yarn. Oh, it's like opening up a bag of sweets. Absolutely beautiful. I'm going to fix my box. So there we go. We'll fix this box out so that we can see what's in it. Oh, look at that. It's absolutely beautiful. Oh, there's paint, but oh, that's really pretty. You can't see that. Look at this. Oh, I've got to try this. Look at this. <gasps> Soft and shiny. It says Diamond Low Piling, and it's by Lamia. It's 100 grams. That's 210 meters, 229 yards. 70%, I think that means acrylic. And 30% microfiber tells you to use a four knitting needle or a three crochet hook. I think with that I would use a four and a half, maybe even a five crochet hook. That is beautiful. Look at that. It looks like a twist. A twist in it. It's absolutely beautiful. This box is quite big and I hope it's just not in your face. Absolutely beautiful. Look at that. I'm going to pop that aside. I'll put that in, in my little basket. Oh, I'm like, oh, what a burst. It's like eating, opening up a box of chocolates. Essential cotton. It's essentials. I have 50 grams in this. This is beautiful. It is so, so soft. It's not glittery. It's shiny. Look at that. That's beautiful. It's 50 grams. 100%. I don't know what that, I don't even want to say that. Bamwoolly. Bamwoolly. It's 100% cotton. It says 100% cotton. That is absolutely beautiful. I'm going to pop that down there in my box. I've got a big basket down there. Look at the, oh there's another one of that. And a cream. Now this is... She it says it's cotton, it's not got a number, a name. That one is says it's 51, the number's 51 on that one. And then there's this little ball of cotton. It says creative cotton, it is so soft, it's beautiful. It's a little 50 gram ball. It tells you to use a number four hook. There is, I'll pop that in my basket, I keep seeing the box, it's a basket that's down here, I'll give that bag to Molly. There you go Molly. And there's another ball of this Essentials of Cotton, it says Rico Design. There is no name, the number is 53 on this colour, it's beautiful, look at that. It's a beautiful colour. That is a beautiful colour, I love that, that's so nice, it's so soft as well, soft and shiny, especially for cotton. Put that down there, and we have got some ice yarn, that is beautiful, look at the colours in that. Now that one has got, it has got a label in there, there's one, two, three and four of those. There's no name, it's a magic light one. This is a magic, I love that stuff. I use that quite often, the magic light. Now, there is no other name on it than the magic light. You've got to go into Ice Yarn to find the names. It's 100% acrylic, it's 100 grams, 360 meters, 
it tells you to use a 4.5 millimeter hook or a US 6 and the weight of this yarn is a 3 it's a 3, it's beautiful that, look at the colours in that absolutely amazing and it's so soft it's really soft I'm going to put those in my basket because we've got quite a bit to go through we will go to the side next we've got some paint box simply chunky paint box is Lovecraft's own branded yarn this is a beautiful colour now they've got numbers they don't have got you online they've got colours but here it's just numbers this is 309 I think this one is coffee I'm not sure it might be something like that's beautiful look at, oh, look at that one that feels amazing so we've got that one and it is simply chunky it's 100% acrylic this is 100 grams that's three and a half ounces 136 meters 149 yards and it's a, a weight five a five so the uk sort of chunky yarn is a five weight in the usa we'll pop that one down in my basket and this little one here oh it's another one of those little diamond ones look at that it's 100 grams 70 percent acrylic and 30 percent microfiber it says it's a weight four it's quite a sort of it is a little bit of a heavyish yarn it's beautiful though look at the way it's spun it's spun absolutely beautiful i bet it doesn't get any splitting or anything in that one yeah i'll need to make something with these that lemon that lemon um oh look at that color's beautiful as well Right, so there's this one, the colour is L065 and it is Lamia Diamond Low Piling Yarn. It's beautiful, soft and shiny. It's beautiful. I'm going to pop that into my basket. I'll go with this lemon one. That's my look at that. Love the shade of I love lemon. I really like lemon. I really do like lemon. I do a lot of lemon blankets. It's beautiful, nice and summery, or it can be nice and light and cheer. It cheers you up. 100 grams again, 210 meters, 229 yards. Weight four. Use a three crochet hook. For this, I would use a four and a half or a five even. I think it would be really pretty. So I think that lemon and that burgundy one would be really nice. that lemon in the blue look at that one it's the same yarns it's beautiful then we'll go this way we've got some simply aran pink baby pink 100 grams it's beautiful it's really soft as well it really is there's a pink one i'll go a little bit quicker because we've got quite a bit there's quite a lot stuffed inside this box it's amazing Thank you so, so much, Sarah. So we've got some white. That's ice yarn. I think that's rockabilly. I think that's a rockabilly yarn. I'm not sure. That's the one that's called rockabilly. Oh, it's Picasso. But I think it's... I'm sure that might be... I like the rockabilly one. It might be that one. Oh, look at that one. Anyway. <laughs> we've got a Simply Aran. Aran is brilliant for making baby blankets and for the autumn and right through to the springtime and even in the summer if you use a bigger hook you'll get a more open pattern so don't think that you can't use Aran yarns in the summertime you can you really can just use a bigger hook for it so this tells you to use a USA or a UK 6 five millimeter crochet hook I would use a six or a six and a half if you're going to do something for the summer with this because I think it's beautiful you don't discount thick yarn in the summertime just use a bigger hook with it it's beautiful I'm going to pop that to the side that's 100 grams in that one and we've got this one this is a robin double knit and it's a black 
it tells you to use a, a four millimeter knitting needle and again I keep telling people as well if you are looking at a label and it only tells you what it only tells you the crochet it's only got knitting needles the shaft of a knitting needle is the same as the working shaft of a crochet hook so if it tells you to use a five millimeter knitting needle use a five millimeter crochet hook it's the same the shaft on them are the same that is brilliant so this has got 300 meters 320 yards it's 100 percent acrylic it's 100 grams and it is black shade 44 for that one and it's by robin and it's a double knitting yarn i'll put that down there where will we go next oh look at this this is really nice knitting essentials super chunky this looks really nice and wintery doesn't it it's like the ones that you would make like your aran jumpers and your cardigans it looks so pretty look at all those beautiful colors as well that is absolutely beautiful and this is a super chunky there's 50 grams in each ball and i'm sure these are the poundland ones where you can buy three for two as well so it's worthwhile looking in all those kind of shops for yarn that is beautiful that is color is beautiful i love that kind of aran type Years ago when my mother knitted and crocheted, when she was doing something and it was in Aran, it was only one cream colour. A lot of the Aran was in one creamy colour. You could get it in browns and blacks as well, but you didn't get it with all these beautiful flecks through it or all these other beautiful, like the, like the chunky yarns and things. I mean, a way back then that would have been classed as an Aran yarn as well. But that's got that lovely old-fashioned Aran colour. It's so pretty. We pop that down there. That's 50 gram balls, by the way. Oh, there's another one of that brand. Oh, that is so soft. That is so soft. That is beautiful. I know it says soft and shiny, but it really, really is. It's so soft. And it's your 100 grams with your 210 metres. The weight is a 4. And it's that Lamia Diamond Low Piling. It's beautiful. I love that. It's amazing. I'll pop that down there. We've got a Hayfield Bonus Chunky. It's extra value. Bonus Chunky. It's amazing. It's soft. It is so soft. A yarn. The Hayfield. All the Hayfield yarn is really soft. No matter how thick it is. And look at that colour. It's 100 grams in here. The shade is 0675. It tells you to use a 6mm crochet hook. That's a US 10 there's, doesn't tell you what your yardage is. Oh, 150 yards, that's 137 metres approximate, and it's 100% acrylic. That is beautiful. Look at the shade of that blue. It's amazing. Put that down into my other basket. What way will we go now? I'm going to keep all this nice red and orange side to the end. <laughs> We've got this. This is Picasso. This is a beautiful ice yarn. Now, if you want some ice yarn, but you don't want to go on the website that's from Turkey and pay that huge amount of money for delivery, you can go on to eBay. There's a lot of Amazon and eBay sellers. You're paying a reasonable price for it and you're not paying that. I'm, I mean, no doubt the delivery cost is in the price, but they can split it all up the way that they buy it. They can split it all up and make it much more affordable to, to get some of this ice yarn. And I've actually saw a lot of Facebook groups and YouTube channels that are all just devoted to ice yarn and things that have been made with ice yarn. And that is beautiful. This is a 50 gram ball. It's called Picasso. It crochets up amazing. The one thing, one thing I will tell you, if you have to rip it out, 
it is quite a soft sort of fluffy yarn and if you try to rip it out uh, or frog it if you're in the USA it's called frogging like you'll rip it rip it rip it out <laughs> I thought that was fantastic when I first heard it them saying rip it rip it rip it is you just sound like a frog saying rip it rip it rip it but anyway, when you pull this out, it kind of catches on it. So just um, when you're doing a pattern, then just keep your eye on it so that you don't have to rip it back too often. It is a beautiful, look at that for colours. It's beautiful and it crochets up amazing and it's super, super soft. I'm going to pop that down there. That's a 50 gram ball and it's 100% acrylic. Now there's more here. <gasps> it's just going on and on now this is the castle as well but it's a different colour so this one it doesn't actually tell you that it's the light blues or the sea blues it just says it's Picasso it's a four weight yarn but it's super soft oh somebody going past the house on a motorbike my goodness so this is an ice yarn, it's 50 grams, it doesn't tell you that a yard did, oh 50 grams, 115 metres, it's, that's it, use a 5mm crochet hook, that's a US, can't read that, it's too small, too small for my eyes, 44% acrylic and 56% polyester, it's beautiful, look at all those little limes and blues, there's even little sort of lilacs, in there it's beautiful this is amazing Sarah thank you so so much thank you pop that back in the bag this is amazing what a wonderful wonderful oh we're not touching all that shades of reds and pinks we're going down this way <laughs> so we've got this now the one thing about a lot of cameras when they see something purple they see it as a navy blue this isn't navy blue and I don't know how to get it to show you that it's actually, it's, you can see it down in there, it is a purple, it's a purple but it's beautiful. This is Simply Aran and it's a paint box and it's so soft, you get your fingers in there and squish them, so good for your sore hands as well, just squishing a ball of yarn like this, move my box away. My computer is all just right there and it's a touch screen it's like one of the older style and anytime something touches it it just sort of <laughs> it pops off in a way in a world of its own that is beautiful it's a hundred grams it's a hundred percent acrylic the number for this is mm. the color number is two four seven it tells you to use a five millimeter crochet hook that is a US eight a UK 6 but I would go with this I would go with a 6 or a 6.5 or even a 7 because it is quite chunky and it's beautiful to work with and this is simply Aran it's amazing for doing blankets I'll put that down there we are going to this you hiding your ball down in there Oh, he's hiding his ball. Now this is a beautiful shade of green. Look at that. That is beautiful. That is beautiful. That is so soft as well. The number for this one is, the colour number is 327 for the colour number for this. It's so soft. I'm going to go a little bit quicker because we've still got some to go on this. We've got these lovely little baby wool, that's so soft. Oh, look at that one, a beautiful yellow, look at that. Oh, that is so gorgeous. Just get your finger just right in there as well, and look at that, you've got a squeeze ball. Your hands, <laughs> it's lovely. I've never seen this brand before. XL baby wool, extra, don't know, not extra large. Um, there's 100 metres, 50 grams, tells you to use a 3mm crochet hook. I wouldn't, that's quite thick for a 3mm crochet hook. That is quite thick, that is lovely. It's so soft. 40% Lana Marano and 20% cashmere. Oh wow, that is so, so beautiful. 
Now the last time I had something that was made with cashmere, I washed it in the washing machine and it went from like a size extra large down to like a little four month old <laughs> You've got to be careful the way that you wash proper wool They are beautiful, look at those colours together, they're beautiful I'll pop them down there Now, I swear that when Mutley grumbles sometimes it really sounds like he's saying mum and he's got his ball struck Right, get your ball There you go, that's it Oh, back up above this ball this box. So, let's go this way We're going to go this way Look at the shade of that This is Signet It's Signet Aran Yarn And it is absolutely beautiful Look at all these shades of pink That's beautiful, look at that That's a lovely one. Oh, that's that other one, look that's that one. Look at it in the pink. Amazing, amazing colours in this yarn. That is so beautiful. I need to do something with that. Look at it in this light. Look at these colours. Look at these colours. These are absolutely beautiful, this yarn. It's absolutely beautiful. It's beautiful. I really love that. It's so soft and shiny as well. I'll pop them down there. So we've got some paint box. We have a Simply Chunky in red. The number for this is 315. We've got one that's kind of like a shocky pink and it's the Aran. This one is Simply Aran. But I'll tell you one thing, the Simply Aran is softer than the Simply Chunky. The Simply Aran is so much softer, it feels so much softer. The number on this one is 251 for that one. And I know this is another one of the paint box. And that is your Simple Chunky in orange. Look at those three colours together. Look at that, that is beautiful. I would go that way with it, I think. Look at that, that is so pretty. So pretty. I'm going to pop them down into that basket. It's getting full. So we've got some Signet Aran in this lovely shade of red. The number for this, it says it is red. It's 12.06 for that. It's 100 grams. It's 100% acrylic. It doesn't tell you what your yardage is on it at all. Nope, but it's beautiful, it's nice and soft. I'll pop that down there, going a little bit quicker. We've got a Red Heart Lisa. This is lovely, I've got quite a few of the Red Heart Lisa. It's a nice soft yarn and it's got nice peaches and nice pale colours in it. This is a 50 gram ball, but when you're on Lovecrafts, and I know they do this on Lovecrafts, when you buy two of these, it works out cheaper than buying a 100 gram ball and it's lovely. This is Red Heart. It's, this one is, I think it's a 4 weight. Oh, it's a 3 weight. It says it's a light 3 weight, but it's like a sort of in between a double knitting and an aran. It's not that thin for a 3 weight. It's really nice. We'll pop that down. Oops, is there a colour? The colour is 08322, there is no actual name for the colour. Then we've got this Hayfield Bonus, look at the colour of that, that is beautiful and it's so soft. Extra value, chunky yarn, 100 grams, 0622, look at that, it's so pretty, I love the colour of that, I wouldn't even know if it was like a peach or... If you've got any idea what colour you might think this is, just stick it in the bottom of in the comments. And then there's this one. This one's like, well, that's a paint box. That's a different one. <laughs> I'm going a little bit quicker because I need to go and let Motley out give him some lunch. We've got this paint box. It's a Simply mm. Chunky. The number on this one is 353. And it's so pretty. It's so soft. 
And that's a simply chunky one. Uh, here we've got, oh, that's another one of those Lamia ones. The diamond low pack. Look the colour of that one. It's beautiful. The colour number on this one is L158. I don't think I gave you the colour number of that pink. The number on this one is L163 for that one. That's beautiful. I love that stuff. It's really nice. Now we're going down here into this bright orange. Look at that. Wow. <laughs> Knock your eyeballs out. You've had a drink or two. That will certainly sober you up. Look at that. That is beautiful. Mm. It is beautiful. Great for making pumpkins and things at Halloween. Do you know what? It's great for adding with white. Look at this white. Now this is a Simply Aran and so is that. And you mix those two colours. <laughs> My friends just shouted, you can make a jacket, a safety jacket for the, <laughs> for the workers. <laughs> you can't. You can mix it with other colours. You can mix it with other oranges as well. So anyway, we've got a white one as well. I'm going to put that back in the box. There is a silver one. This is a Simply Aran and that one is, um, that goes under silver. The number is 204 for that. Now, for this one, the number is 257. I'm going a little bit quicker here. And the number for this white one is 200. That's, I think it's ice white. Now, we've got this one as a simply, uh, uh, the simply chunky paint box as well. The number on this one is 343. That is a beautiful colour. I'm just going a little bit quicker because Muttley needs his dinner. Look at this, this is lovely. It's stuck to that tape on the bottom of the bag. That is a beautiful twist in that yarn. Look at that, it's a lovely twist in there. This is called Lake. I don't know what that says. It's 100 grams, that's 130 metres. See, it's made in Turkey. The colour number is X728. It's beautiful. It's a beautiful shade of Burberry, like a, a berry colour. It's almost like that one there. It's just a little bit lighter. We've got another 50 gram ball of Red Heart Lisa. This is a pink one. There is a paint box, Simply Chunky. The number for this one, I think this one's baby pink, it is 352. That's 100 grams of that. This is amazing, Sarah. It's absolutely amazing. And this one is the Red Heart Lisa. As this one, the number for this is 05690. And then we have this one. James C. Brett's Top Value Double Knitting. Look at the colour of that. And it's so soft. Even though it says it's a top value, it's still a very nice soft yarn. We're nearly there, Molly. <laughs> now we've got these. These are ice yarns. They go under ice. They go under cakes DK. Now you've got to go on to ice yarn to figure out what the the colourway is. That is so pretty that. I'm not going to take it out of the bag. Now it's a hundred, is there a hundred grams or more in each of these? Oh, it says there it's cream pink mm. cakes, cream pink, this one. And I think it's a 200 gram ball, if I remember correctly. These cakes are 200 grams, that is beautiful. And the, this one, this is a pack of two. This is olive green, olive green, and it's the the cakes, cakes DK. They are beautiful mm. colours. Great for a man, great for a man. These colours, and I like the way they've got them all sort of mixed. Now with cakes, you can either start with the yarn on the outside, or you can start on the inside. What I found, if you start with the inside with one ball, then start on the outside with the other. It comes out really nice and even in its stripes. Now this one, this one is the cakes again. 
and it's dark grey this one it says dark grey but there's no greys in there dark grey B that's beautiful I would say it's more blues there is grey there but most of the other colours are all sort of mustard and mm. autumn colours are beautiful make a beautiful shawl or a scarf with 200 grams you can still get a nice size shawl believe me you can just with that you would get a really nice size scarf or a shawl even a little scarf and a hat for a child as well keep them nice and cozy and warm anyway Sarah thank you so so much for this it's amazing a real beautiful box of yarn it was it's been even better than eating a box of chocolates it's absolutely amazing thank you so so much now if you haven't subscribed to my channel then please subscribe to the channel and if you click on the bell icon then youtube will tell you when i put up another tutorial he's actually got the ball stuck somewhere and i need to go and find where it is so until the next time sarah amazing amazing mm. happy box thank you so much for this happy meal it's amazing and so until the next time happy crafting and i'll see you all again soon goodbye